Hello, I'm Richard. And a while back we uh, presented a video featuring this open range Mesa Ridge fifth wheel. In that video we did a little uh, walk around of the exterior of the fifth wheel. And so in today's video we're going to do a little tour of the inside uh, and we're going to do it uh, in two ways. First we're going to show you the inside with the slides in to show you the uh, room and, and one of the reasons why we liked this particular model was that we were able to do everything with the slides in that we could do with the slides out. All your cabinets, everything is accessible with the slides in. So we'll take a quick view with the slides in and then we'll put the slides out and uh, show you the, the tour with, with everything open. So stay with me. All right, let's take a look at the inside. Uh, excuse the background noise, we had the power go out. That's so we're running on backup generator. This is uh, the open range Mesa Ridge 346 FLR. So when you come in the door, turn on the lights, you come into the kitchen. So there's a hallway there. There's the kitchen sink, double sink, stainless steel sink with the Corian countertop. The uh, oven, stove, microwave, and refrigerator are on a slide. The front room, which is in the front, the living room, is three steps up. And if you're not too large, you can fit through there real nice. My wife and I can fit through there real easy. We have the chairs while we're on the road. Uh, the dining room table chairs sitting on the floor right there. But, like I said, you still with the slides in, there's two slides here. One with the uh, theater seating, the other with the uh, fireplace and television. And you're still far enough away from the TV and everything with the slides in that it's very comfortable to sit there and watch TV with the slides in. There's a Corian countertop here. There's the table. It's got a drop leaf and it, uh, it bolts to the floor right there with a couple of twist thumb screws. Uh, three of those that hold it there while you uh, travel. All these cabinet doors, everything you can get into and reach. That's with the slide in. You can still reach it. I can still get into this cupboard down here. Everything opens all the way. Drawer slides all the way open. Even with that slide in. So then there's three more steps up here to the hallway. The door in front of me takes you into the bedroom. The wardrobe's on the slide so you can't go this way when the slide is in. This takes you to the bedroom, or the bathroom, I mean. And so the bathroom, you have your sink and medicine cabinet, mirror. You have another mirror, cabinet, large counter space, washer, and, uh, uh, you know, a uh, washing machine, dryer, hookups in that cabinet. We just use it for, uh, you know, a hamper and uh, storage got your uh, shower and the throne porcelain throne but it's quite roomy in the uh, bathroom I mean two people can be in here doing something not a problem and then the bedroom in the back 
so that wardrobe goes out when it's in you can't walk around one side of the bed but you still can go around the other two sides and normally the largest walk around area is where the, the slide is so that'll go out and you have drawers there you can get into above the bed and of course you can still get into the wardrobe and there's uh, cubbies and drawers here everything is still accessible with the slide bed. so plenty of room even when the slides are in I don't know what the square footage is with the slides in when they're out it's about 388 if I remember correctly so let's put the slides out and we'll take a look at the uh, the trailer with the slides out all right let's take a little look inside with the uh, slides out I mentioned in the exterior video <clears> that this thing sits up pretty high there's four steps to get inside so you come into the kitchen area and so there's the hallway to the bedroom and bathroom the sink and countertop, Corian countertop, lots of cabinets, just tons of storage. Good size refrigerator, freezer. This is the table and it's normal position you could put it anywhere it's a freestanding table we've even put it up in the front room uh, put the leaf up the leaf is down right now and have four of us sit around it and play cards and so forth but normally it sits right here in the kitchen area once again up the three steps to the front room here here's your Theater seating, sofa with uh, it's a, it's a fold-out sofa, um, entertainment center stuff right there. There's the uh, fireplace and uh, television. Again, lots of storage. Storage above the sofa. The cabinets have lights in them, so just matter of fact, when we first got the trailer, I told my wife, you know, they ought to have a light in here. I reached in there, sure enough, they do. <laughs> and there's storage behind the television, and uh, it's probably at least a foot deep. There's a shelf. Let me see if I can get to where the lighting is better. Let me try this. So, I mean, you could put <clears throat> all sorts of other accessories in there. Uh, audio, entertainment type accessories. There's an outlet that's not even being used, you know, a duplex. Um, so, it's just got... Uh, an abundant amount of storage for us with just two people. Let's, uh, here's the view from the uh, front room, shooting towards the back kitchen. The hallway, you have a cabinet right here, top of the steps. It's got all your controls for your tank levels, the slides, everything. The uh, 
ceiling fan, all that stuff's in here. And then there's a coat closet, broom closet. And then straight ahead is the bedroom. Wardrobe on the uh, side wall here. So with the wardrobe out, there's just a lot of floor space. Plenty of room for a couple people to change their clothes or do whatever. You got lots of cabinets above the bed. There's five doors. Lots of room in the uh, closet. So double door closet, there's a built-in dresser in there. Here's the door to the bathroom. So the bathroom can be shut off. There's a sliding door. Large cabinet up here. Nice size shower. Where's the nice porcelain throne? You've got medicine cabinet. He said there's two mirrors in here. Um, and so then the door back out to the hallway. Like I said, it's uh, very comfortable for a couple people. Um, lots of storage both inside and out, which was a big attraction for me. And the fact that you can do everything with the slides open. I mean, you can do everything with them closed as you can with it open. So anyway, just a quick tour of the uh, open range Mesa Ridge uh, 346 FLR trailer. Um, I just kind of hit, you know, kind of the highlights. But like I said, it, it feels very, very roomy, very comfortable. Uh, this is definitely a size that you could live in. The only downside to a trailer like this is, you know, it's it's a little bit the tow. And if uh, if you're squeamish about towing something that weighs 14,000 pounds and is uh, 38 feet long, then this probably is not the trailer for you. But for every pleasure, there's a pain. And the downside to this is that it's you get all the room that it has. It takes up uh, <laughs> a lot of real estate going down the road. Anyway, hopefully that kind of answers all the questions regarding what the heck's that thing in the background. We appreciate questions and comments. We just ask that you direct them to uh, an email address and not on the YouTube channel itself. See you next time.